Hey guys, how's it going? Chez back again, and welcome to episode number six of the Football Manager streams here on uh, FM2016. If you're watching on YouTube, feel free to skip forward a few minutes to where we actually get going in the background. I'll tie in the actual genuine starting of playing the game with uh, loading the save up in the background so you know exactly when uh, to uh, to stop fast forwarding etc but uh, obviously the opening few moments are spent just setting up the stream in the background etc and me welcoming people in which is what I'm going to do now so hopefully people will be joining us in the process of the next two or three minutes I need to put the little notification video live as well so that everybody on YouTube knows that we're going live right now with Football Manager and hopefully we can crack on and continue what yesterday was some very good form actually we had terrible form on Wednesday, but Thursday, last night, we had some decent form. So we'll try and recoup that if we can. I'll just put this little uh, notification video live. Bear with me. And then we'll get going. Nightbot should already be in the stream, because I don't think I removed it from after the COD stream. So it should still be there. Hey, guys. Welcome back to the stream. If you were here earlier, if you weren't, welcome to the stream. Right, just put that little video live. Let's uh, tweet out as well. Live now. Oh, there we go. Right, the notification video has gone live as well. Everybody's on their way in. Over on Twitch as well. Hello. Whoa. That was rather loud in my ears. I just got this subscriber uh, notification. I don't know whether it was a resub or whether it was me losing a subscriber. We'll find out once I refresh. Nothing has popped up in the chat. If someone has just resubbed, then click the little notification thing that lets me know that you've resubbed. If I just refresh this, it should tell me over on T-Notify. It's DC 1991 Thank you very much, Steve. Your resubscription has just come through. I shall adjust my overlay from 76 to 77 subscribers. Thank you very much, Steve. Your continued support is very much appreciated. I think that's four months, is it now? Four months or five months uh, consecutively that you've been subscribed now. Plus, obviously, your donation here and there as well. Let's update that. There we go. 77 subscribers. Right, let's jump in. Let's jump in and we'll get cracking. And we'll get cracking. Yes, yes, let's go. And JWPW has subscribed for three months in a row as well. That's just popped up in the chat. Thank you very much, uh, JW. And then there's Steez. Steez1991 subscribed for four months in a row. It was four. I thought it was. Should have done it early in the week, but I had no money till today. Well, I appreciate that when you did get money, you went out of your way to resubscribe, Steez. It's very kind of you. Right. We have Notts County next, who are seventh. One point above us. It's so tight in the league. Let's actually go to the league table here so you can see it bigger on the screen in front of me. It's so ridiculously tight. From 5th to 12th is separated by 3 points. So if results went Hartlepool's way, they could go from 12th to 5th in one game. Which is pretty mental. Pretty mental. We are almost halfway through the league season. Obviously, 22, 23 games, sorry, will be halfway through. So we've got four games to go until we're halfway through our first season here at Cambridge. We were in great form yesterday, and the last two games didn't quite go our way. So we're hoping for slightly better fortunes. The red card situation is still an issue, which is not the funnest thing in the world, or most fun thing in the world, I'm making up words. Funnest. Is that a word? Is funnest a word? I'm actually going to have to Google that. Funnest. Is funnest a word? Superlative adjective, funnest. Yes, good. It is a word. I am pleased. I didn't just make up a word or have terrible grammar. Do, 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 
Do, do, do, do, do, do, do. Uh, I've got the Derby Forest game on above me. It's still 1 0 Forest after 63 minutes. Forest scored very early on, though. Very early on. Hopefully, you can bring us some luck, Phil. Fingers crossed. Uh, Lee eligible for professional contracts. Not yet, Sunshine. Not yet, Sunshine. A bonnet to miss Dortmund game. That's a shame for West Ham. So everybody should be fit, apart from Colson and Luke Berry and Keith Keane suspended. Great. Saucy Dad and Derby letting you down for your bet. Yeah, I don't think, well, don't want to tempt fate. I've got a good friend who's a Forest fan. But I don't think Derby are going to get a win in this one. Or have you got? have you just got both teams to score? If you've got both teams to score, you might be in with a shell. But I don't see Derby winning it. But obviously now that I've said that, they'll go and score three. In the last 20 minutes. Right. Swans... Wow. Chelsea are just terrible. in On FM as well as in real life. Still 8th in the league, having played 14 games. That's madness. Liverpool top with 32 points. Lol. Fitness tests. Recommended to be limited to a maximum of 60 minutes action. So Berry could play. Berry could play. Alright. Let's take off pass into space, now that I've remembered to do that. Uh Leon Leg is in good form, as is Luke Wilkinson. And Mikey. Oh, we could, if he's still only 77% fit. I'm just not going to risk him. I'm just not going to risk him, I don't think. We will put Morrissey and Ryan Donison there. We'll swap Donison with uh, Connor Newton. He can play in that role. We'll put Jeff Hughes there. And obviously it has to be John Akinde and Rory Gaffney up top. Rory Gaffney, Rory, Rory Gaffney. Right, Sam Besson, uh, George Taft, who I would be interested in making that transfer move permanent. Liam Hughes. We are very close to December. We're not far away from the January from the January transfer window now. Mark Roberts can go on the bench. Uh, I'm not going to put. I'm not going to put Berry on the bench. It's just no point. Robbie Simpson can go on the bench because he can play centre mid as well. And Barry Core. Uh, we might give Daniel Carr a go in a game that's against lesser opposition. F County are favourites for this as well, which doesn't necessarily fill me with confidence. They've got Jimmy Spencer up top who isn't scoring goals this season. Okay. He's barely played this season. Who's there? Have they got play a striker injured. They've got John Stead who's been scoring their goals, but he's out injured right now with a damaged neck for three to five days. That might be very, very handy for us. And Isaiah McLeod is unhappy, apparently. Asked to leave the club because he wants first-team football. Why would you not play Isaiah McLeod? It's a strange decision. I mean, I'll take it. I'm glad they're not playing Isaiah McLeod, but still... Uh, Liam BCFC 96 just subscribed. Thank you very much, Liam. I will alter my. Can I turn that down? Yeah. I will alter my uh, overlay again. Thank you very much for the subscription. You are subscriber number 78 right now. So let's refresh the overlay again. Ba bomb. Cheers, Liam. I appreciate that, bro. Everybody should give you the sub hype emote in the chat. We'll start spamming the subway email. If you want to follow on Twitter, by the way, anybody that is uh, newly subscribed or hasn't or has subscribed and still hasn't gotten a follow off me on Twitter, put your Twitter accounts in the um, in the chat, and I will follow you. Let me just quickly update my overlay. I think I accidentally saved it as a as something else. We're just getting that clear. Good. I have. I've saved that as a picture rather than a PNG. Oops. File, save as PNG. Save as P 
PNG. There we go. And now it should update to 78. There we go, that's better. Let me check the chat in case any of you put your Twitters in there. You did not. But Johnny Kinde is going to put that ball just wide, unfortunately. So, boy. But yeah, if I, if I don't follow you on Twitter and you're subscribed to me on Twitch, then let me know and I will follow you. Also, bear in mind, everybody who's subscribed to my Twitch channel, everybody that's subscribed to my Twitch channel gets free postage on the No Identity Clothing Store. So if you are wanting to order a t-shirt, then make sure you message me on Twitch or on Twitter first. And you will get, I'll send you a, uh, a code, a free code, free shipping code, if you want to order a t-shirt. It's been quite an end-to-end -end game so far. We may end the half with a goal. John Akinde misses the target again. Oh, got to do better than that, John. John Akinde at the beginning of the season probably wouldn't have missed those opportunities, to be completely honest, but I will assertively say, please with how things are going, keep it up. So we are playing quite well here. I just followed Julian. Thank you for putting your Twitter in the chat. Uh, I select moderators, Ollie. I don't. You, there isn't like a specific thing you have to do to become a mod. Go on, Rory, get there. Oh, I just manually select moderators. Cross it, Ryan. Oh, don't tell me Connor Newton's going to bang one from distance. No, he's not. It's a good ball out wide to Mikey, though. Just won't quite go in for us just yet. I know I'm watching Forest Derby, not the Salford game, Adam. Are you gonna go and order a shirt now? Are you Max? Drop me a Twitch mess. Drop there. Drop me a Twitch message, Max, uh, and I will send you over a free shipping code. Uh, whilst we're streaming now, yeah. Drop me. Drop me a message. Drop me a Twitch message, and I will reply to you with a free shipping code for you. freshen things up shall we uh, I don't really want to take Connor off because he's a good player but he's having a bad game so we'll put uh, Robbie Simpson on uh, are you on Twitter Max I followed you earlier didn't I I'll send you a DM on Twitter if you like with the code if it's easier it was Max was it Max G 2002 or something wasn't it Max Green 2002 there you go I'll, let, I'll send you a Twitter DM, bro. Send direct message. There you go. I just sent you a DM on Twitter with um, with a free shipping code for you. Come on, boys. On the counter. They're getting a man sent off. They're getting a man sent off. See you later, Zalyukas. Right, we've got 15 minutes. 15 minutes to get ourselves a winner. Take that back. Time has just decided to completely disappear on us. Now we have less than 5 minutes to get ourselves a winner. If we can get a winner though, that would be fantastic for confidence. If we concede, that would be... Awful. <laughs> Jesus, we nearly did as well. Come on, boys. Pick it up. Uh, 
so it's going to be a nil-nil draw by the looks of things. Nil-nil draw. It's not the worst. That's not the worst um, result in the world. Just say unlucky, boys. It wasn't our day. Uh, yeah, the link to the shop. There you go. Link in the shop is in the chat now. Hey, Rasmus. Thanks for joining, bro. Let's move this up to ninth, though. At that point, let's move Notts County down to eighth. So we're now right behind them. Jeeps, whoever that is for Forest is absolutely rapid. They're number 15. He just flew all the way down the pitch. Stephen has just sacked Teddy Sheringham as manager. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Chris Dunn kept a clean sheet. GG, bro. Highest quality. Eight shots faced, saved all of them and got a clean sheet on 8.5 rating. Well done, Chris. Well done. Who have we got next in the league? Doncaster in the FA Cup next. Okay, great. It's not going to be the easiest of games, but never mind. Core drops, lack of first team football concern. Good. So we should have done. Colson asked to discuss personal matters, right? So as soon as one player decides, yeah, I'm fine, someone else has gone. Ah, ta -ta, ta -ta. Oh, I just... Foxy369 just subscribed. Thank you very much, Foxy. Everybody's subscribing tonight. It's fantastic. Ask Roberts to intervene. Could ask Robert, Mark Roberts to intervene. Uh, just having a tough time. I'd really appreciate it, Captain. You can have a word and see if you can help. Uh, willing to try it, okay. Good. So we'll see if the captain can sort something out for us. Thank you very much for the subscription, Foxy. If you want to follow on Twitter as well, then, like I say, put your put your Twitter handle in the chat. And I will follow you. And if you yourself would like a <laughs> discount code for the clothing site, then let me know, and I will whack over... A free shipping code for you. Let me update the thing. There we go. 79 subscribers. Fantastic. You should have your emoticon, etc. Emoticons, etc. Why is it not letting me advance? It says must respond. I have to speak to call to him anyway. Okay. He better perform. I'll play him in the in the cup game. Your Twitter is Michael Fox nineteen ninety eight. I will copy that and then I will go over to Twitter and I will follow you. There you go. I just followed you on Twitter, fam. Thank you very much for the subscription, bro. No, no, Ryan. Why? Oh, we avoid a game, a red card for a game, and then everybody gets injured instead. No okay, games United players involved in any of those. Never mind. Chambers listed for loan. How did he, well did he get on in his loan? Oh, he didn't go out on loan. He went out on loan. Never mind. Job confidence is secure. Luke Berry is back in full time training, which is good. The sound tends to skip once in a while for you, does it? It shouldn't do. Simpsons wants to discuss. Wow, well, everybody's not happy at first, not getting first team football. I will start Robbie Simpson though.
Well, it's good to have you back, Gilbo. Even if you aren't subscribed, that's not a, that's not a problem. But just the fact that you're here is is good enough for me. I appreciate the support, bro. Coming back to watch the stream. <laughs> I did follow you on Twitter, Liam, yes. Are you dead? Yeah, bills are a pain in the arse, aren't they, Gilbert? <laughs> Uh, what month are we in? You can see top right, bro. You can see the date in the top right. 5th of December are on right now. Elliot on the zoo. Do we have a game midweek? Please don't tell me we have a game midweek. We don't. We don't have a game till Saturday against Plymouth. Good. Good. Oh, I've already put on the zoo. Yeah, we're going for setbacks. All right, well, I said I'd give Josh Coulson a run out, so we'll put Josh Coulson in. And we'll play Luke Wilkinson and Mikey. Gonna play a strong side. I can't play Ryan Donaldson out wide, so let's give Welps a run out. And Connor there. Is Berry fully fit yet? He is. He's not match sharp, but doesn't matter. The only way to get match sharp is to have minutes on the pitch. We'll put Robbie Simpson up top alongside Johnny Kinde. See if Kinde can rekindle some form. Hey, George Taft. Oh. Barry, Barry Core? No, not Barry Core. Rory Gaffney's the striker that's going to go on the bench. Um, we will put Leon Leg on the bench. We will put. I was going to go Keith Keane, but I can't because he's suspended. Of course he is. Liam Hughes and then Morrissey or Carl Morrissey or Carl Morrissey. Ah, oh, brilliant, Max. I appreciate that, bro. Okay, Foxy, no worries, bro. Thank you for coming on and subscribing. I appreciate that. And we'll uh, we'll see you next time. Playing a very narrow formation. Certainly. Uh, nobody expects us to get results. Go out and enjoy playing without having any pressure on you. It. I won't jinx it. It's 8 a.m. in the morning in Australia at the minute, is it? Bloody hell. Bloody hell. I always forget you guys. Well, I don't forget, but it's weird that you guys live in the future. Oh, yeah, that's a great ball by Keegan up to Williams. It's a very, very good goal. Apparently he was offside. Uh, that's the store. Sorry, I just see you try and put the uh, command in the chat, Admiral. Eight a.m. is usually in the morning. Yes, sometimes. <laughs> yeah, you're an hour ahead of us in Sweden, aren't you? I think all the Scandinavian countries are an hour ahead. You have to go a little bit further east before uh, you reach the two hour. Go on, thread that through. Robbie! Oh. Wow, still! How Stuckman saved that second effort. That's madness. Up you go. Oh. Good cross, please, Luke. Well, Johnny King, they can smash it. He tried. Oh, he's deflected it in! 
It's a, is it an own goal? It is an own goal for Richie Wellens. We will take it. 1-0 up against League One opposition. Tie very much. How do I stream and do YouTube? How do I fit it all into a schedule? Uh, by working every waking hour. That's how I do it. I wake up, I make videos, I stream, I make videos, I go to sleep. And they're equalised. Immediately. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh. Decent finish, in fairness. Uh, no, no, this is an FA Cup match, Joshua. It's the second round of the FA Cup, but you can see top left here, whenever we're on this screen. FA Cup second round. I don't use a specific camera angle, bro. I leave it to the director to decide. You could just leave the game to select whichever camera angle it sees fit. 3.13 in the afternoon there. Oh, you are six hours behind? So you're what? It's kind of... That's Central American time, isn't it? If you're six hours behind. Like Chicago-ish. Well, to be fair, the country's so bloody big, it could be anywhere within thousands of miles. But you know what I mean. That's a good cross. Welps, Akinde brings it down. Akinde finishes. Akinde might be back in form, boys. He might be back in form. I would be thrilled if he was. It's a nice cross by Welpdale, brought down well by Akinde, and then really tidily finished into the bottom corner. Goal, 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 goal. Assertively, don't get complacent. Take that the right way, they did good. good. Sometimes you can say, um, don't get complacent, and they'll give you a dirty look. But they took that the right way, which is good. I'm probably going to stream some Black Ops 3 multiplayer later, George. Oh, it's a good save. It's a very important save as well. Probably going to stream... I'll finish the Football Manager stream, go and have like a half-hour break, and then I'll probably start streaming Black Ops multiplayer with some friends. Probably without face cam, because I was streaming the campaign for like four hours this afternoon. And I'll be honest, it's getting pretty hot underneath these studio lights for hours on end. But Connor Newton's just scored a third. 3-1 up away from home against Doncaster. What is this? I mean, we'll take it. It's fantastic, but what is this? Oh, we nearly got a fourth. We nearly got a fourth. CJW, thanks for coming out, bro. Yeah, at least FM, FM is FM fifteen is a good game though, Jay. Or Jai, I don't know how you pronounce your first name. I know some people that pronounce it Jay and some people that pronounce it Jai. So don't score. Oh, we hit the post. Right. Who's but is anybody booked? If someone, I'm going to take Luke Berry off because he's shattered. We'll put Morrissey in. Hopefully he'll have a decent game. Uh, Josh is not that sharp, but still his condition is alright and he's playing well. So we'll leave him on. And Robbie Simpson's having an okay game as well. Uh, well. We'll leave Robbie on for now. We haven't got any body books yet. Just thinking 
<laughs> red card territory. Uh, any plans for signings in the transfer window? Not as of yet. We want to. I know I've got a couple of players I want to move out first because clearly we're not able to offer everybody as much first team football as we might have liked. You still playing FM fourteen? You never really got into fifteen, so probably won't buy sixteen. Sixteen is probably more of an more of an advancement from fifteen than fifteen was from fourteen. I would have said. I definitely say it's worth it's worth your while picking up at least judging by the beta at least I mean you can always pick it up three or four months down the line when it's dropped in price anyway can't you it's out for a full year so uh, I'm going to passionately say that was really special well done boys fantastiche we're into the third round of the FA Cup where we could we could we could get Premier League opposition which would be a nice little money spinner Done. Conceded, but never mind. A 1-1 one -one draw. Akinde impresses, which he does. Oh, it's pronounced J. I will remember that. Or at least try and remember that. <laughs> Foster dropped by England. You got a virus on your PC, that sucks. I mean, Liam Hughes wants to discuss personal terms. So he's not getting enough football. Uh... I think a low move is the best. Yes, okay, good. It's the only thing when you've got such a large squad, you need a big squad because of all the amount of games you have to play, but at the same time, you can't keep everybody happy. I've got plenty of Cambridge shirts, Brett. Loads of Cambridge shirts. Right. Who are we going to get in the third round of the FA Cup? Predictions in the chat. Are we going to get a Premier League side? Are we going to get a Championship side? Because they're in the they're in the draw for the first time now in the third round, obviously. Who are we going to get? Four minutes added on at the City Ground. Burnley, Brighton, Man City, Hull, Reading. Your English is perfect, Thomas. There's not been anything wrong with the English I've seen you write in the chat to this point. You think we'll get Premier League opponents, do you? Well, we'll find out, shall we? There are 72 teams to draw. Or 71 teams. There must be some in there for replays, potentially. I don't know. How many tiny teams are there still in the competition? I'm looking for non-league sides, but... I don't think I can see any. There are any, I don't think. I think it's all Football League sides now. There are no minnows left in the competition. It's all Football League sides. So any draw could be dif could be very difficult. Forrester on the breakaway. That was a heavy touch. Oh, he's going for it. Oh, it's that number 15 again. Who is it? I can't quite see his number. Well, I can see his number, I can't quite see his name. Oh, I'm just about to show it. We haven't been drawn yet. I don't... Uh, I'd rather... If we're going to get a big tie, I'd rather a massive tie. I don't kind of want like a mid-table championship side, that's just pointless. And we want to be at home as well, so we can generate as much money as possible. At home first, get a draw, and then get a money-spinning away tie as well. That would be good. It's 
Still not out of the hat yet. Sunderland, Swindon. There's only 13 teams left to draw. It's going to be Bournemouth, Cheltenham, Huddersfield, Watford, Derby, Reading or West Brom. Derby, Watford, Cheltenham, Reading, West Brom. Watford away maybe? Watford away. We've got Watford away in the FA Cup third round. That could be a good money spinner for us. BPL opposition in the FA Cup. We could earn a little bit of money from that. We could earn a bit of money from that. I'll take that. Uh, Jordan Slew. They won, but he didn't really. They came off in the 60th minute. How is he getting on out on loan at Wrexham? He scored two goals in five games. Not bad. Although one of them was a penalty. Mourinho unhappy. I told you he's not good enough. I told you that previously. I'm just going to send him back. Just going to send him back, I think. Do they have Bundesliga licenses this year? I presume they don't. Well, they do. Unless, no, that might be part of my... Oh, no, they're called Gelsenkirchen, not Schalke. Dortmund. Yeah, no, they don't have licenses. They've got badges and stuff, but I think that's from my badge pack. Yeah, they don't have Bundesliga licenses. That sucks. I'll have to... Who was that out with a twisted knee? I'll have to... Uh, Try and get hold of one. Oh, it's from someone that doesn't matter. Paul Morgan takes charge at Barnet. That's a strange appointment. Yeah, I hate that as well, Glandering. I don't even know why they offer you the option. Like, why would you leave someone... Why would you send someone to a physio with the flu? Yeah, the finance graph isn't the best. We've made a loss of 312,000 this season, but we have spent a lot in the transfer window. I did buy, I have bought like 400,000, 505,000 pounds worth of players. So that's why. We could definitely try and peak that with a couple of sales in January and we'll see that uh, game against... Watford in the Lee in their cup. I'm going to play the same side that played against Watford because I uh, played against Doncaster, sorry, because they did very well there. Uh, no, it was Welps on the right, wasn't it? Welps on the right. Connor. Barry. And Jeff. His name was Jeff. Uh, Robbie Simpson and John Akimde. Why do I play Rory Gaffney? I really want to play Rory Gaffney. Come on, Rory, you can do it. Score me a fucking goal, will you? Rory Gaffney, Rory, Rory Gaffney. Early on leg. Taft. De Hughes. De Hughes, that's, that's uh, a word that doesn't make any sense. Right, let's put Daniel Carr on the bench and Robert Simpson. Uh, I'm just going to calmly say, great opportunity to show the critics. Go and get a good result. Sub on Daniel Carr. Where should where should I play at? Daniel Carr Admiral, where do you play him to get the best out of him? Up top or out wide on the right hand side? Oh, how's that squeezed in? Own goal. What channel's the Salford game on? Oh, it just hit him.
What time was the Salford game on? I was going nuts about Salford, but I don't know whether it's. I can't see it on TV. Oh, it's on BBC Two. There you go. Ma match of the day live. Salford City versus Notts County. Gary Neville going mental. Gary Neville and Paul Scholes going absolutely mental. And Nicky Butt. They're all bouncing around like little kids. <laughs> I love that. Right, I want to see much better out of you in the second half. Oh, is it an FA Cup first round game? I didn't realise it was an FA Cup game. Of course it's not Capital One Cup, what am I even talking about? Come on boys, let's get ourselves back in it, shall we? Welps is on the run. Okay, Thomas. Look forward to it, bro. They're just getting every every rebound. Every rebound is going in for them. Right, I'm going to take Rory Gaffney off. See, again, Rory Gaffney is in terrible form right now, and it's really frustrating. Berry's coming off as well for Morrissey. We'll try Daniel Carr up top. Like, the first goal was a lucky rebound and an own goal. That one has gone straight back to him. I mean, they've had the possession and the chances, you can't deny them that, but it's still frustrating. <laughs> You're a Barnet fan, sorry for stealing the Kinde, bro. Oh, Daniel Carr! That was so close. So close to one back. Please, please. A 3 0 defeat is an absolute kick in the nuts. Yeah, I'm not going to sing the Rory Gaffney song meaningfully until he actually starts scoring goals. Score, Jeff, square that. Or shoot. He's offside anyway. Jeff. Jeff. That's a good cross. Fuck. That's a good cross. Oh, it just won't drop for us. It just won't drop for us. Daniel Carr! We got one back. Admiral was on, on point. We got one back. Good finish as well, drilling that in the near post. Come on, the boys! Jeff Hughes is looking exhausting. Exhausting, exhausted. He is. He is looking very tired. Um, Liam Hughes can go out wide on the left. He plays everywhere, bloody hells. Uh, no, don't watch Stoke at 4am in the morning when you're busy. Or when you've got a busy morning planned. 
Oh. That's such a good goal. God damn it, Leroy. We get one back. Hope is raised and then bleh. <laughs> nope. Destroyed. Hope is destroyed. John Akinde strained his wrist. Great. If he's out for a long time with a strained wrist, I will be so disappointed. And annoyed. I thought Daniel Carr went in two feet, two, uh, two footed on the goalkeeper there. It was a mixture of in with two feet and two footed. He went in two feeted. Chez out is a murmur in the fans. Nah, not after one result, fam. Not not happy with that, though, boys. Not happy with that at all. Pleased with Daniel Carr though, coming off the bench to get a goal. Might have to start him ahead of. Rory McCory. Rory McCory. How can you be out with a strained wrist for two weeks? Man the fuck up. God damn it. Fucking shit out, dude. Nightbot's a computer program, George. There's no point swearing at it. Dismiss to the coaching team. Alan Nil is a manager, isn't he? Yeah. Darren Sarr is a coach at Stevenage. Nope. Move. No. Fine, remove that one. But we'll leave the rest. A Salford gonna make it in the football world? I have no idea, mate. To be honest, they've got a long way to go, but they're going about it the right way. They're going about it the right way, so who knows, you know? Uh, I have been to Ashton Gate, Liam. Yeah, pheasant asked to discuss personal matters. We played three times, we've conceded seven goals. That might be why. No disrespect, but I'm already in a position to be playing regular and don't feel really that I've got anything to prove. Uh. Not happy at how you've dealt with this. Well, get over it. Oh god, just as I want to play Daniel Carr. So now Akinde and Carr are both out injured. Strain during a weight session. Fuck. Steps back from caretaker manager role. What? Oh, because Connolly's take David. David Connolly? Bloody hell. As if he's taken the managerial role. That's mad. He was banging the goals in back in the day. Go away, you little buzzy bastard. Oh, for fuck's sake. You just got sacked after 37 days at Villa. How did you manage that, James? After 37 days? Slew scored a brace. Oh, they played Redditch. Was it FA Trophy? Yeah, it must have been. The one we scored to, they're shit. Alan Nil takes the job at Stevenage. He was supposed to be who we were recommended to sign. Oh, 
I'm probably going to give away FM16 for the November subscriber giveaway, Louis. At the end of the month. Sunderland are terrible, you're right, on a snowy day. They're not the best. 12 red cards in 14 games, that's incredible. I was counting, you've got 6 minutes to get themselves back in it, otherwise they're out of the FA Cup. Chelsea fortunate to beat Man City, doesn't matter. 20 fouls, bloody hell, get stuck in lads. Big win though, moves Chelsea up to 7th. Go on the boys! Great. Tell you what, you pick it. Joe Rodriguez, Robbie Simpson, Jeff Hughes, Barry, Connor, Newton, Wilps. Du -du 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 -du. If you say so, I will trust your judgment. You got annoyed at the board and told the press you were pissed. It's probably not the best of ideas to be on this red circle. This is going to be a difficult game. This is going to be a difficult game. I'm going to assertively say, do it for the fans. Do it for the fans. Dr. Benji got sacked on the first day because he didn't go to the press conference. Is that true? I didn't see him tweet about it. Come on, Cambridge. Come on, Cambridge. 31% possession, though, so far. Oh, if that had flown tops, I would have gone out of this world mental. Yeah, that was that was a phrase that doesn't make any sense. I would have gone out of this world mental. Why have we only had 31% possession so far? As soon as I take off the retain possession thing... We have none of the ball. We do, however, have a goal. Joe Rodriguez. He should be finishing that, though. He's on his own. He's completely unmarked there. Look at him. There's nobody with him whatsoever. If he didn't finish that, I'd be disappointed. But it's still a good header. Take nothing away from the lad. It's a good header. No, Mourinho shouldn't get sacked. Goal, 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 goal. Still only 35% possession there, man. I'm eating mini cola bottles. Oh. Mini Haribo cola bottles. See you, Liam. Best of luck on the away trip, bro. Thank you for subscribing tonight. Keep it up, lads. Keep it up. Still only 38% position. I like having a lot of the ball. I like having a lot of the ball, but... He may just be... Mansfield are very good at holding on to it, so... If that goes in... Blair around the corner to Marsden. Well blocked. Well blocked.
Uh, is it not connecting with your Twitter profile properly, Gilbo? It should just be in the settings. I don't know what the defender's doing there. If Welp scores here, that was mad. That's a terrible corner. Hey, Summer Games. We've got a penalty. Is he going to send him as well? He's not. Robbie Simpson's going to take the penalty, though, I think. Or is it Jeff Hughes? It might be Jeff Hughes, actually. In fact, I think it is Jeff Hughes. It is Jeff Hughes. Rolls up his socks, prepares for the spot kick, and it's saved. Ugh. Fuck my life. You just want everyone to know how little of a life you actually have. <laughs> oh, as if we missed a bloody penalty. As if we missed a bloody penalty. Oh, t the Twitter is bugged for more people, is it? Uh, Berry's coming off for Morrissey. Yep. Liam Hughes for Connor. Do 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 do. Yeah, and then we are going to stick on retain possession. We'll go shorter passing as well. Let's keep it short. Work for each other. If the stream's lagging for you, you high underscore YouTube, then drop the quality of the stream, bro. Wow, we get a 1-0 win with only 40% possession. Certainly. Uh... Yeah, never mind. We'll just tell him it was good. It was all well done. We're up to ninth. Huzzah! Just lower the, lower the quality that you're viewing in. Or refresh the stream. Either should work. Slew didn't score because it was 0 0. Omazuzi gets man the match. Well done, boys. Well done. Who have we got next? Dakinham and Redbridge, great. Mark Roberts wants to discuss first team for... Oh, I'll start you. I can't piss my captain off, really, can I? It's not fair. Everyone's starting to get a bit disgruntled now because they're not getting enough football. Yeah, the conference is in there, Roman. By default, uh, in England, you get BPL, Championship, League 1, League 2, National Conference, and then National Conference North and South. You get four, uh, all seven leagues. You can, although there, might, there probably isn't, uh, patches for it yet but obviously oh I should have gone to that press conference but last year and on every previous year people create patches you can have down to like the 12th tier of English football they just add in user made patches Keep telling me about Ryan Horn, I really don't care. Let's save it.
We got. Oh god, it's Boxing Day. So we've got we've got Dagenham here on Saturday, and then we've got Barnet on the Monday. Shit. And then we'll have a day a game on Box on Trans. I know. Or we have a game on the second. Ugh. I don't like that. I don't like that. Time is it? It's only ten to ten. It's only ten to ten. Right, Brazovan. I'm gonna play my strongest players against. Oh, but Barnet are a good side as well. Fuck. I Mark Roberts and Josh Coulson. Considering they've both been desperate for first team football. Uh, go on in, George. We'll give you a game and all. We'll give you a game and all. Welps. Morrissey. <laughs> Berry's been playing terribly. Connor Newton. Dunk. Barry Core, Joe, Joe Rodriguez, Gordon. And then we'll play a stronger side against Barnet. Mikey. Leon Leg. Keith Keane is back. Actually, let's play Keith Keane at CDM instead of Connor Newton. Liam Hughes on the bench. Jeff Hughes on the bench. Rory Gaffney on the bench. Good luck, lads. We're going to lose this. Pretty sure we're going to lose this. Jesus, it's raining hard, isn't it? Good save, Peter. We still only not got much possession. Still not had much possession, although it is only uh, the opening five minutes or so. That could improve. Uh, my Facebook link is updated to the new one, isn't it? Yeah, my Facebook link is updated to the new one. What was that, Welps? One nil. Called it. He was offside. We're going to have to keep possession. So dribble less. Adopt a pass first mentality. Oh, what a ball that is. Joe Rodriguez is in. He's missed. Mer. The face goal here. Thank you. See you, Caspia. Uh, we'll have a look at we'll have a look at players when we get to the transfer window. He didn't get banned, hi YouTube. He just got timed out because he kept spamming the same question. Oh, 
I put Be More Disciplined on because we had a real problem with red cards. So I was hoping that if people were more disciplined, they'd be less reckless in tackles. Oh! Why have you given away a penalty there? We're almost at half time. We almost made it to half time after being demolished for the most for most of the game, and then we give away a penalty. Great. Oh, he almost kept it out as well. Give me more in the second half, boys. This has not been good enough. Trying to get him to pass short. Let's get him to pass shorter. Oh, Shell Rodriguez, what a finish. We're not in the transfer window yet, Dark Sonic. Now is your moment, Rory. Now is your moment. Uh, my top's kick name, I don't know off the top of my head. Let me check. Uh, the game is £35 on Steam, that ginger kid. Where's my Tops Kick up? There it is. My name on Tops Kick is Real Chesnoid. My name on Tops Kick is Real Chesnoid. Oh, they missed. But my phone screen is so dirty. It's so dirty. A lot of us do use Tops Kick, Mimo, yeah. It's a good app. I wouldn't promote... Well, I can only speak for me personally, but I wouldn't promote something that I didn't use or didn't think that you guys would enjoy. If I promote something, it's because either A, I use it, or B, I think it's a good service. I'm just going to tell them I'm not happy with that. We didn't play well enough. Yeah, Cambridge poor performance had to defeat, so shut, shut up, yeah. Tactics, right. Now all of the brrr, instructions, we're gonna go shorter passing. We'll turn off run at defence. <sighs> higher tempo with shorter passing. We'll try that. Try a higher tempo with shorter passing.
I'm not lying at all, Isaac. There have been numerous people that have wanted me to promote stuff, and I've just flat out said no. Yeah, we could put it on control. We'll try it. We'll try going on control. Oh, man. Slu didn't score. Put, he put in a pot, solid display. Well done, son. Ryan Donaldson's back from injury, but too late to play in this game. That's why we integrate it with FIFA, Isaac. It's good. It's fun to play on your phone, but just to do top skip for a YouTube video is not that entertaining. Which is why we mix it in with FIFA and we do the challenges and stuff. They're good videos, and it's not as if it replaces anything else that I put on the channel. They're always extra videos. Facebook link under my stream is not working, is it not? Let me check. Let me check. Where is it? Facebook, 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 Facebook. Uh, try now. It should work now. There you go. It's working now. I just had to fiddle with it slightly. Yeah, you're quite entitled to your opinion, Isaac. I'd never slate someone for having an opinion. Let me turn the TV off. I don't want to watch that. But just because your opinion is one way doesn't mean that I'm not allowed to have a, have an opinion the other way. Right, some person wants a game, we'll bloody play him then, shall we? God, everybody's going to be so tired, though, from the game. Go away, you little buzzy shithouse. I will. Good. You have to hunt him. Pardon me. Leon Leg, Luke Wilkinson, Mikey. Connor on the right. Go on then, we'll play Donaldson, even though he's only just back from injury. Barrier holding. Jeff Hughes on the left. Akinde is the target man. Is Rory Gaffney better? Anything other than that. Could be a good poacher. We'll try him as a poacher. We'll try Rory as a poacher, see if that helps. I'm a Zuzi's a bit tired, isn't he? Oh, he's only he's on ninety, but God, everybody's so tired. What happens when games are like once every two days? Liam Hughes is wanted by someone apparently. Ebb's fleet. Buzz in. Enjoy that loan deal when it comes in, won't you, mate? Morrissey. Robbie Simpson. Shall Rodriguez. Yeah, well, I might start trying a 4 4 one, one rather than a 4 4 two. We are favourites here against Barnet, but there are three of us here on 33 points and Barnet are on 32. I'm just going to tell him I want to win. Just say, look, I want to win from this one, boys. Tell him to play shorter passing. We'll see if this works. Oh, 
for me. Oh, how has he scored that? Keeper. That's why I haven't been playing Sam Besson. Because he's shite. He begs me and begs me and begs me and begs me to start him. And then two minutes in, concedes. Great. Cheers, Sam. Why can we not pass two yards to each other? They're playing the sort of football that I want to play, and I'm trying to tell them to play. Go on, Connor, square it. Rory's there. Rory! He scored at last! Rory Gaffney, Rory, Rory Gaffney, Rory Gaffney, Rory, Rory Gaffney. He's done it! Rory Gaffney scores a goal for the first time in fucking forever. Uh, I'm not keen on the idea of YouTube Red, to be honest, Mimo. It sounds good in theory, but the way they distribute the money isn't isn't helpful enough for... Oh! Jeff Hughes on the volley Mers. We're 2-1 in front, boys. The way they distribute the money for YouTube Red just isn't right, in my opinion. It, like, your... The percentage of your YouTube Red subscription should go to the people that you watch, not just into a giant pool and then based on overall minutes watched. It's a rich get richer type scheme. So everybody that's already got uh, the biggest channels and get billions of minutes watched a month, they'll get all the money and all of us smaller channels barely see anything. You sent me a trade on Top's Kick. I'll have a look after the stream, Rad Circle. I'll have a look after the stream, bro. Uh, still room for improvement. Uh, I'm not going to create a club, Kuzik. I don't like... A, I don't like doing things like that. And B, that's exactly what Spencer's done. And I don't want to just... do exactly what Spencer's done. If you enjoy that sort of thing, then... you should watch Spencer for it. You missed that header, Luke. Don't foul him. Oh, what a save. Chest for the Wembley Cup. I can't play football because of my health, so I couldn't play in the Wembley Cup even if I was invited. Yeah, I've never been keen on like create a club type stuff. I'm all for realism, so creating a club and like putting it in a league just uh, just doesn't appeal to me personally. No, I'm nowhere near big enough to have gotten an invite to the Wembley Cup, bro. Like, when they did that, I was on, like, 50k. Oh! Yes! Akinde, 3-1. That's a lovely cross by Newton. Lovely cross. And Akinde's just arrived at the right time.
Bloody hell. Ryan Donaldson scores a free kick. It's 4-1. It's 4-1. What's going on? It wasn't even that good a free kick, to be honest. Maybe the changes we made to uh, to the tactics are actually working. Although we've only had 40... We've had less than 50% possession. And I have asked them to... Re look, we got... Oh, we haven't got retain possession on. I didn't realise that. I'll turn retain possession on as well as how short a pass in. Well, to be fair, why would I change things? They seem to be working anyway. Never mind. Pass it, Ryan. Thank you. Stand there for ages. I think that just hit Rory more than anything else. But it's 5-1. Rory Gaffney scores again. I think it just hit him. It just hit him on the back. He didn't shoot. You can see from the replay, it just hit him on the back. Wrong footed the keeper, so he fell over and trickled in the bottom corner. I mean, that was phenomenal. That was absolutely exactly what we needed. We're up to seventh. We're in the playoffs. We're in the playoffs. I don't know when the next FIFA stream will be, Nick. Probably a, a couple of weeks, I would have thought. Sunderland sacks Sam Allardyce. And they're rock bottom in the Premier League with 11 points from 20 games. Well, at least parts of Football Manager are realistic. Sunderland are shite. I'm always going to be consistent with my content, Red Circle. You'll all, always get at least one video a day from me. You'll always get at least one video a day. Uh, John Akinde's getting a bloody contract offer, I'll tell you that much. What's he on at the minute? 1.1k, and he's asked for 975k. He's taken a wage cut. I'll take that. Cheers, pal. Chris Dunn, meh. I don't really care about the others. We will. S Do we sign Chris Dunn? Go on then. He's on. S he's on six fifty. He wants seven seven five. Ah, uh, walk away. CBA. We will offer. Not interested in entering contract discussions. Unsure whether it's in my best interest to work for Cambridge, considering they're not exactly playing a strong level of competition. Screw you, Jess George. In real life, would never, ever, ever ever say that ever 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 like, what do you want? 800 and you're on 150 Really? You could turn down that. Oh, fuck it, you can have it. Transfer window scouting reports. George Long. Really? Add to shortlist and Joe Rafferty at right back. These guys would never sign for me though. I could surely I could never afford their wages. He's only on 750 quid a week. I'll add him to shortlist. But we've got 
we've got so many players already. I can't be looking to sign people just yet. We're about to go into the January transfer window, but I want to get I want to move on a couple of players before we sign before we even think about signing anyone else. Messi named as world golden ball winner. Ronaldo not even in the top 3. Messi wins the Ballon d'Or. James Rodriguez comes second and Juan Mata comes third. Bloody hell. James gets World Player of the Year. And Messi only comes third in that same three players. Team of the Year is Neuer, Lahm, P.K. Hummels, Ricardo Rodriguez, De Bruyne, Silva, James, Mata, Alexis, Aguero. A lot of BPL players in there. A lot of BPL players in there. Pardon me. Right, now we know that we want to move on Greg Taylor, so we will now offer Greg to clubs. We know we want to sell on Harrison Dunk, so we will offer Harrison to clubs. Liam Hughes wants to leave on loan. But we'll wait on that one because he's a good utility player. And everybody else, I'm kind of happy to leave. You reckon we should sell Barry Core? He's not scored in eight games at all. He's not scored for us at all this season. I mean, I could play, I could play him at centre back. Thing is, he scored goals for South End, but. John Akinde just immediately took his first team place, unfortunately. I'd feel bad, though, selling Barry Core. Because he's so good in real life at Cambridge. People don't hate him anymore. He's on one and a half grand a week, though. That'd come in handy. Three positives. Happy to see the club performing well in the league. Happy with training. Thinks Hughes is a good player. Jeff Hughes. Jeff Hughes is a very, very, very good player. I'm not going to buy Pozo. Barry Core is a diving wimp. No, they don't hate him anymore. They did. They did hate him, but they don't anymore. I'm so pleased Gaffney scored a goal. Like, how's that for a fucking scoring drill? That's mental. about time he started banging the ball in the back of the net again. Do we don't, we do we don't, we do we don't, we do we don't we. Go on then. Sorry Barry. The club could probably do us some money actually to be fair. Wait, hold up. George Tiles loan's finished. No! Come back, George! I want to loan him. Not willing to allow him to leave the club due to his first team commitments. Have a word. We've just had him on loan for the first six months of the season. Shut your mouth. I want to hear back about Greg Taylor. We've got Wimbledon on the second anyway, so we'll play that. But it is almost half past ten. FA Cup game against Watford coming up as well. Board confidence update. They're happy. No offers for three players. Ask. Uh, I'm under contract and I have to see it out. Ugh. Two months ago, he wanted to leave.
Uh, your resub didn't it didn't make a noise. Uh, Cal said, "Moo, no." Have you got the little? Um, have you got the little thing at the top of your chat? If you're watching on PC, see ya, Admiral. Thanks for popping out again, bro. If you've got, if you're on PC, Cal said, "Moo," it will at the top of the chat box. It will give you a little thing that you can click, and it will come up in the chat. I don't, I don't think it comes up on mobile. It might do, actually. I'm not sure. They might have added it in. Lone bid rejected for George Taft. <laughs> gimme in. Gimme, gimme, gimme. George Taft. What work transfer? We could probably buy him. Suggest terms. It wants 700 and... Really? He's valued at 54,000. They clearly don't want to sell him. Seven hundred and seventy five grand when he's valued at fifty. It came up in the chat for you. Let me scroll up. How long ago did you do it? It didn't come it didn't come up in the chat for me, I didn't see it. I might have missed it, but I don't think I don't think I missed it. Scroll up, scroll up, scroll up. I just was it before or after you went chairs in the chat? Oh no, it did. I see it. Cal said move. Subscribed for four months in a row. I apologise. I missed it in the chat coming up. I apologise, bro. I must have been distracted. Thank you very much to Cal said move for subscribing for four months in a row. <laughs> Sorry I missed it, man. Right, Brazovan's definitely playing here. Omazuzi. Luke Wilkinson, uh, Mikey, Connor on the right, Morrissey in the middle, Berry holding, Jeff Hughes on the left, and then hopefully Akinde and Rory Gaffney, Rory, Rory Gaffney can renew, can continue their renewed partnership up top. Matt Roberts on the bench. Keith Keane. I'm tempted to sell Keith Keane, actually. For lack of a better phrase, I'm not overly keen on him. <laughs> You're now eight hours behind, so it's even worse than being five hours behind. How do you mean, bro? Have you have you moved? Are you in the states and have you moved? I presume that's the case. Like moved from east coast to west coast, or at least from eastern standard to uh, western. The western Pacific, isn't it? Pacific standard, eastern and Pacific, assertively. Uh, we should be winning this one as well. They're twentieth in the league. Come on, boys. You're at school on the West Coast now, yeah. At what level are you studying? Cal said Moo. Like, how old are you? Are you at, still at high school? Are you at college or at middle school? College in the PST. So that's, college is 18 plus, isn't it? It's effectively like university in the UK, I think. Yeah, 18. Oh, go on, John. Have you missed? Oh, son, you've got to do better than that. Got to do better than that, boy. Norway for the win. That's a good ball. Rory's going to keep it in. Akendi! Oh, we won the lot, boys. Came buried. Cambridge, 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 Cambridge. Everybody loves football manager, yeah, from all around the world. Oh, it's nearly two. It is two. Yeah. 
Luke Wilkinson gets his first ever goal in the Cambridge shirt. <laughs> Belgium, mate. Are you in Belgium, fabulous chicken? I didn't know that. At least I don't think I knew that. If you are. Pardon me. Goal, 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 goal. Assertively, very pleased with how you're playing. Let's keep it up. Hello, Tesloid. Hello, Gavin McGuinness. Uh, I haven't been watching Class of 92, no. Fabulous chicken. Yeah, mate, best beer in the world. <laughs> ah, I don't know. Germans are pretty good at beer. <laughs> Not keen on Stella, to be honest. Morrissey's not having a very good game. We'll put on Liam Hughes. Maybe that'll make him decide to stay because he's had one more substitute appearance. Have I ever been to Germany? I've been to Germany once, Jamdam. I went to Germany for the... Chelsea versus Leverkusen game back in 2011, November 2011. Went to Chelsea Leverkusen, which was four years ago now, which is mad. Oh, what a goal! I can't quite believe that was four years ago, but it was. Yeah, I'm not keen. I'm not keen on Stella. That, that was legitness. We just got a donation. I will check that now. Thank you very much. It's a pound from DV Gaming. It says, "Hey, Tez, I love your career mode, career modes, and streams. Hope you don't mind, but can you check out my YouTube channel and give me some tips? What sort of tips are you after, DV Gaming? Let me know in the chat, and I'll see what I can if I have any responses. What sort of tips are you after, bro? Looks like we're about to get a two-one win against Wimbledon, though." Go on, Jeff. Go on, Jeff. Fireworks going off again. Blow your whistle, ref. Blow your whistle, ref. Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah, I'm using my own tactic. I've never used... I've never used a... Um, like a, a meta set of tactics and taken tactics from anyone else I've always just made them myself I don't go too far in depth you see that's why that's another win for us uh, I haven't tried I haven't tried uh, Jubler or Grimberg no I shall have to and then get back to you shan't I I don't have a second favourite League 2 side, Cal said, Moo. Oh, of course he reaches a card limit. So what's our form look like right now? Indifferent. We're winning more than we're doing anything else, so... That's decent. Yeah, definitely Harvard Neze. I'm oh, sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that, I'll just call you Harvard. Or Havard. Eight, an 8GB i3 is definitely uh, fast enough to be able to run uh, Football Manager. Pardon me. I don't like salad. Cal said me. What do I think about Bateson's haircut? I think it's wonderful. Right, so we have some money to spend in the window but 
we need to move players on before we bring players in. That's the most important thing right now. It's not a case of adding to the squad. It's a case of upgrading who's already here. Anything like quality or commentary? Well, when it comes to quality, you ha these days you have to be in HD. At least 720p. You have to be at least in 720p. 1080p is obviously fantastic, but 720p I'd say is a must. And when it comes to commentary, just be yourself. Like, commentary takes practice. It took me a good 18 months to kind of nail down a commentary style that suited me for YouTube videos. Just practice, 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 practice. And you will eventually find a style that suits you. But be confident with it. Like over over enunciate at times and be if you project your voice you come across as more enthusiastic and more confident and it will be a more entertaining um a more entertaining commentary. Oh you've got the old guy HD sixty. Yeah you should be good then. <laughs> Although apparently the ability to spell Elgato <laughs> is beyond you. <laughs> But yeah, we are effectively replacing what we've got here at Cambridge now. Replacing what we've got, rather than... We added to the squad in the, in the summer, and now we're going to be replacing people. But we will do that tomorrow night, because it's half past ten. I'm going to go away for... I'm going to uh, go away for about half an hour or so, and then, depending on what uh, a group of friends are doing, I may... I may stream... Um, some Black Ops multiplayer. Not promising anything for tonight. Over the weekend, as in Saturday and Sunday, I probably will because um, they're uh, my sister's away and she's in the room next to me, so I can be louder later. So I'll probably, I'll definitely stream some multiplayer late at night, Saturday and Sunday. I'm not. I may be live again in half an hour-ish. I may not be live again in half an hour-ish. If I do go live, I probably won't have the face cam on. Because I've been sat under these lights for about six hours now this afternoon. Pretty warm in here right now. And uh, I don't really fancy sitting under the lights for a little bit longer. But if I do go live again, then uh, you'll be able to find out on Twitter, obviously. And if you follow the YouTube channel, then obviously you'll get a notification when I go live anyway. But that's going to bring this stream to a close. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you're watching on YouTube, drop the video a thumbs up rating. Let me know your feedback in the comments. And uh, I hope to see you in the stream soon. There's obviously links in the description to my Twitch channel and to my Twitter, etc. But for now, thank you very much for watching, guys. Really appreciate all the support tonight. Thank you for the multitude of subscriptions. We had Max subscribed, Stee resubbed, Liam subbed, Foxy subbed. We had Cal said Moo redo his subscription as well. We had a lot of real, really, really good support tonight. And we had a pound donation from DV Gaming as well. So thank you very much to all of you for your support. And I might see you in half an hour. I might not. We'll find out, I suppose. <laughs>